I met Luis Alcaraz Pineda, once my enemy, now my partner, in our tag team boxing match, March 4th in Telford, England. Some fight that was, but that's for another video. We'll talk all about the fight and review the whole fight in the next video. For this video, I just wanna talk about me and Pineda becoming friends and building a relationship in the ring, outside the ring, and now that we're not having to fight each other, he's actually a pretty nice guy. I first met Pineda at the media workouts in London before our fight last weekend. There was so much going on, we didn't get to speak a lot. The language barrier is tough, obviously. But uh, when we got to Telford and we were staying in the same hotel is when we actually got to spend some time together and hang out. We even went to go train together. He's a nice kid, man. He's a really sweet guy. I really like him. It was an honor to be his partner. It was a fun fight. I'd like to see us team up again. We were hanging out in the boxing gym, running through the motions on how we were going to tag in, tag out, stuff like that. That's when we got to spend some time and talk. We had a lot of fun, man. He was getting some of my jokes. I feel like it would be hard for a fella who doesn't know English to understand me especially because I speak with so much slang. I cuss so much and a lot of things that I say don't make no sense. So, but he was getting it. We were using the translators. Two of my coaches, Danny and uh, Zoe, speak Spanish. So they were helping translate as well. He's a really nice guy. Even after the fight, I even posted a picture. Me and Pineda had some beers after the fight, got a little turned up. Unfortunately, I got too turned up and was throwing up the whole plane ride home. It was absolutely awful, man. Every fucking 30 minutes for five hours, I was throwing up. I was in a heap. I can't drink like I used to. I might be softening up because of the boxing training. It's got my liver not working as strong as it used to, but I recovered from that now anyways, and it's the day after we got back. So today's Monday. We fought on Saturday night. I wanted to film some more footage with Pineda one-on-one -on -one where we uh, got to show a little bit more of our personality, but because of the time restraint, we didn't really get to do that. But make sure you comment down below if you want me to fly Pineda out to LA and give y'all a whole couple of YouTube videos of me and him interacting and hanging out, training together and going to do some fun stuff around LA. I'll take him around, show him around the place. I'm definitely willing to do that if you guys want me to. So uh, just drop a comment down below if you want me to. Pineda, he's a quirky guy, man. A lot of times we weren't even using our translators. We were kind of just speaking to each other with what we could and piecing things together. We were just laughing our asses off the whole time we were hanging out, just having a hell of a time. It's crazy because not too long ago, me and Pineda were fighting to the death in the ring in Wembley Arena in London, England. And then some weeks later, now we're best buds. Will we fight again and get a rematch going? Uh, I don't know, man. I, before this tag team match, I was really dead set on getting a rematch going with Pineda. But now I think that I like us more as a team. I like us more together as friends. And uh, I think that the Pineda and B-Dave friendship is something that would really resonate with you guys. Well, I think that you guys would really enjoy seeing more of us together. So I don't know, maybe we don't do the rematch. Maybe we put the rematch off to later in the year. But right now I'm not interested on in fighting him. I'm more so interested on just being his partner, being his friend, growing together. And if we ever do get that rematch going, it'll be out of pure respect on my behalf anyways. It's nothing but respect for Pineda. And he's a good fighter. He's a good warrior. And I look forward to seeing him in some of his own solo fights as well. Who do you guys want to see Pineda fight next? Make sure to leave that in the comments below. I have some ideas, but I'd like to hear what you guys think. And also, if you guys have any ideas on who me and Pineda should face together as a tag team again, comment down below who you guys would want to see us fight because uh, we're definitely looking forward to another tag team match at some point this year and I don't know exactly when we're going to do that. That's probably going to wrap up this video guys, but please make sure to like and subscribe. I'm really appreciating all the love that y'all have been giving me on YouTube. We're over 200k subscribers right now. It's an absolute blessing. I've been wanting to be a YouTuber since I was a little boy and the fact that all this is coming to fruition is, is such a blessing and I'm so thankful for it. I promise to stay the same. I'll never change and I'm so excited to keep growing this YouTube channel with y'all. Please subscribe so you guys can see more videos. Uh, I really love making these for y'all. So uh, I'll catch y'all in the next one.